If you've driven I-40 between Hydro and Weatherford, you may have noticed this friendly looking and growing collection of red barns. When you exit the interstate and investigate further, you'll find that this slice of Americana actually stands alongside the old Route 66 and that you have arrived at P-Bar Farms. Much like the maze for which P-Bar Farms is known, this one-time working family farm switched directions abruptly in the year 2000 and started down a new path. It was an answer to prayer. Uh, prayed that God would put some fun back in our farming operation and this is what he allowed us to do. So this was a working wheat field right here where we're standing and there was wheat planted and, and we were growing that and then we had the opportunity to, to get into this and, and found out that we could make a living doing agritainment and so no longer do we farm, we actually rent our farms out and just keep 50 acres of agritainment here. The list of farm themed activities here is a long one. My girls, like most kids, were drawn like a magnet to the petting zoo and begged me to let them each have a bunny of their own. Luckily, there were lots of things to distract them here, like the barrel train ride and the grasshopper, a bounce pillow that really keeps kids jumping. Inside one of the barns, you'll find laser tag, which becomes haunted laser tag during the month of October. And this time of year, folks come from all over to take an authentic tractor-pulled hayride out to the pumpkin patch to choose their very own pumpkin straight from the vine. We grow the pumpkins here on the farm, and that's another thing that's kind of different from some of the other places. Maybe they, they bring their pumpkins in, so we grow them here, and we enjoy doing that. It's a lot of fun. The kids enjoy it. It takes forever to pick out a pumpkin. The pumpkin patch neighbors the corn maze, and this maze isn't kidding around. It's carved into a seven-acre cornfield, and the seven-foot-high puzzle contains more than 95 decision points. 300,000 corn stalks and three and a half miles of twists and turns. Most maze goers will require an hour to discover the one and only exit. You can climb the tower to get a different vantage point of the maze and little ones can make a hasty exit via the tower slide. There's also a snack bar as well as a table filled barn perfect for birthday parties and tongue and cheek farm themed extras everywhere you look that'll keep you chuckling. But as the sun sets on these serene acres, at least over at the corn maze, things suddenly don't seem quite so charming or funny. Uh, we call it the scary maze. It's, it gets pretty scary. Uh, people go through, they're not allowed to use any flashlights, so it's complete darkness out in a field of corn that's eight foot tall, and uh, they don't really know where we are, so when we show up, we tend to scare them pretty good. Complete darkness is tough to show on television, but a quick listen to our corn maze journey should give you some insight into the experience. <laughs> Having a screaming good time at P-Bar Farms in Hydro, I'm Shell Wagner.